Welcome to the Barons! And the very first deck that we're gonna play here is a whopper of one from Trump Laboratories. It is the Grand Slam Hunter with Carnival Clan. All made possible by Primordial Protector drawing the highest cost spell and summoning a random minion with the highest cost. Uh, the Grand Slam being an excellent card to draw. That enables Carnival Clown to be corrupted and you can search up Carnival Clown with Talon Fordring. We got Kazakus in here too. It's a value fiesta in here. The Madman! Oh, hello, Firebat. No doubt playing a silly control warlock. But can this control warlock outvalue the Grand Slam? That was a pretty tough call, actually. Looks like Bats wants to uh, draw his deck really fast. <laughs> really, really fast. I'm looking for a few good Let's see. They tend to have destroy a minion type thing, so Divine Shield won't be useful. I think Stealth will actually be quite good against, um, you know, the Siphon Soul. And Summon a Copy, that's pretty good. Job's done. Do you hear? My only regret is that Firevat might die too fast before he gets to see the Grand Slam. Five fives? How convenient. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Only 12 cards left in that deck. Soon he'll be active. But I'm gonna have my clown, I'll have my Grand Slam. Your spells are poisonous. It's really good of Bola Shot. Now, uh, 2 plus 2 does clear that. Seems good. Discover first, blah blah blah. <laughs> Wab it. Oh, that's true. Quick shot would have been better. Because this thing kills three things. I don't want to kill his death rattle minion. I want to make him have to make the trade if he wants to get the death rattle. I'm not gonna do the work for him. I guess I'm just used to a uh, bullet shot not being that good. So I was like, all right, let me use it. Here we go. Yes. Rotten to the core. Eighteen, eighteen, and draw a card. Not just any card, though. Not Grand Slam. Yeah, he's got Grand Slam, doesn't he? How do I clear Grand Slam? That's a good question. Hopefully I have stuff in play before then. Though admittedly, this turn I don't actually have a good play. It's worth waiting a turn, isn't it? No, I guess it isn't. I'm just gonna tempo that one out and I guess that's it. Okay, let's find Manric's wife. 
Oh, law order. <laughs> Didn't find it. No life. Very sad. Alright, here we go. So I think it's very likely he'll have, like, um, what should I call it? Pow? Uh, Twisting Nether or another DL5, so I'll save this thing, Majigi. And I guess this will clear the way for Carnival Clan. <laughs> oh, well, boom. Question mark? Oh, wife burned. <laughs> oh, I think this is a great time to play the 10. I think this is a great turn to play this while he uh, probably can't afford to play AoE while playing his payoff card. I think the payoff card costs five mana. There it is. Okay, so he's gonna take two fatigue next turn. So he's at 12, 9, 6, 3, 1. So I'm one damage off. Oh, that would have had like two chances to win. Oh well, I'll give. I'll give him a chance. Oh, I don't have an AoE for this, but yeah, we did. Womp womp that. Oh, it's a dog druid. Alright, that promises to be good. But I have Kazakus. Oh man, is he gonna go for the astral? Wait, if he does, I can play the Grand Slam and then Clown, potentially. Getting ahead of myself then. Celestial, yes. Dog is the type that would play a Celestial alignment deck. Oh, I, why, why didn't I just punch it? <gasps> I'm dumb, I lost two health and I lost a coin. Maybe I should get a Kazakus uh, 10. God, tracking is actually so good in this deck. Since you don't burn the rest now. Uh, that actually is really important, and you really want to find Primordial Protect. I actually think I'm going to get the 10 drop. He has the alignment next turn, I think. Here, let's go. Uh, rush, stealth, rush, and give all your other minions plus four. four. Oh, those are the three loser choices right there. All right, align me, boy. Oh, oh. Oh, wow. Of course.
Oh my god. Oh no. Oh, that was your turn? Oh no, 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 no. My only hope is dog plays alignment. Oh no. Oh no. Despair. So sad. I am the saddest. If I hadn't just gone ahead and picked 10 drop, maybe I'd have a chance to. Has to be a celestial alignment deck there, right? Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh no, my clown! Oh boy, the Nagrand Slam! admit I hadn't thought about this. Wait, this is cool. Dog is like the druid maestro. Oh, wow. What the? What the? That's a bad turn. <laughs> Holy crap, that's a deck. Even with my perfect planning. I was hoping those would all hit face, Womp Womp. <laughs> Trump playing Hunter. Well, if I know one thing about Trump, guys, he's not playing Peppa Guy Hunter. You know when Trump will play face Hunter, guys? I will insta concede, okay? Oh no, Tice was the one who revealed the Altar of Fire. Don't do this to yourself, Tice. You don't have to play a card just because you revealed it. You don't have to do it, Tice. Wait. That looks pretty face hunter, to be honest. Trump? Trump? Although, he just put cards in his deck, so probably not going to be the burn-your-own-deck deck. That was extreme. This is not what we stood for. It's kind of good for me. It's one of the big answers to the, uh, well, to the Kodo and the clowns. But I guess his hand was getting too full or something. Team 
beast. Let's see. No hyena. Hatchet. Hmm. Nah, hatchet. It's neck, I guess. Good card. Okay, so if I play this first, I guess I don't have to track. I'll just play Snake Trap. It's definitely a control warlock deck. Um, probably one that tries to win with Jaraxxus. It's so far looking like uh, the deck that I put together. I don't... No, I've, I've seen Backfire though. Backfire is not in my deck. Mine is a more uh, methodical control warlock deck. Jaraxxus is really good. And he had the deal 5 to everything and trash your deck. So it's probably that portal deck again. I think I've seen enough of that portal deck already to see that it's uh, rather bad. Okay, um, face, 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 face. He drew a 10 mana spell. What is even a 10 mana hunter spell? And I think, I don't, right, this is the Twisting Nether turn, so I shouldn't play this. Although, I guess it's uncertain whether or not they even play Twisting Nether, huh? I definitely have to quick shot that thing to prevent the life steal. Well, it's not essential actually. I think no matter what, because of the positioning, there's like no good way to do it. Womp. Oblivion, Trump. Ha ha ha! Could he really have been saving the? Ah, oh, there is alter- oh. Wow, he burned all the worst cards in his deck! You're so lucky! You're so lucky! Okay, the other Nick Grand Slam is still in my deck, so this is good.
By the way, that Mankirk's card, like, I did consider it. I think it does not cost three mana. It's zero mana, right? So it's actually very hard to find off of, uh, whatchamacallit, the five Barak. Uh, I, rather, I should say it's impossible. Yeah, it has no mana cost. Oh, it does cost three. Okay. It's just a visual error right now. Okay. So I think this actually goes 10 and I have plays for days. Hmm. There's no time to ever cast... Uh, I'll go 10. Like, maybe the 10 drop will end up being better than the Grand Slam. Inferno! Drop! You are so dead! That's a cool way to make sure you don't deck out. I think he probably has Soul Ren, so if I just deal one damage to both of those, that'll be good. Hopefully, no, uh, whatchamacallit. Oh no. That's pretty bad, actually, guys. Oh, yes. Oh my what god, the? what was That's that? That's amazing! Oh no, stop! Do useless things! Oh no! No, no, no! <laughs> oh no! No, no, no! What are you doing? Oh no! Oh, that was really, really bad. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh no. There is a traitor among us. Well, three, uh, three whatchamacallits coming, the primes. It's kind of spooky. Too bad I <laughs> wasted slate that early. Blood for blood. Show us what you got, Trump. Are you running out of? Oh my God! He has more clowns. How many rounds can I scrap against Jaraxxus for? You got six cards added to the deck. Amazing. Nice. 
does seem like a turn where I should definitely be playing this and a bunch of spells. been Jaraxxus for a very long time, so this is a very impressive long rally. Oh, wow. Mm. That has 8 durability, right? <laughs> oh my god, he actually runs Nero in his deck. Jerexus. 17. Oh, he is lethal. Man, new Jerexus is so awesome, guys. What a slug fest. Actually, Thice got really lucky that game. He didn't draw any of his altar of fires. <laughs> That's so unlucky for me.